What's up, Wolfpack? Do you struggle to buy enough food for yourself and your household every month? Do you often find yourself lacking necessities and nutritional staples, despite spending a third of your paycheck on groceries? The Cupboard Student Food Pantries are here to help you. The Cupboard Student Food Pantry is primarily located on the Truex campus and at Goodman South. There are shelves for grab-and-go items at Regional and Commercial Ave. We will discuss those shelf locations later in the video. While you must visit the Truex Health Building in person, the cupboard is primarily a drive or walk-up operation. Every week, a student is allowed a 10 to 12 pound bag of food, which they can pick up at the GHC clinic entrance at the circular drive behind the health building. Signs will be posted. The Goodman South Food Pantry is located as a drive or walk-up in the shipping and receiving entrance. Signs are also posted there. Please visit the site in the description for more information about food pantry schedule and correct pickup times. How do you know if you're eligible for the cupboard services? If you have any kind of food insecurity and are a degree credit student, you are allowed food and other supplies from the cupboard student food pantries at Truex or Goodman South. Be sure to bring your student ID as the peer health educators will need to confirm that you are a degree credit student. At your first visit, you can also specify if you have any food allergies, food preferences, or what other things you may need, such as toilet paper or laundry detergent. You may also receive freebies with your bag of food, such as your happy birthday package, which includes all the supplies for a birthday cake on your special day. Not a degree credit student, but still facing food insecurity? Don't worry. The cupboard is full of helpful community resources available to all students. They host several campus events and classes, including a crockpot cooking class, fresh produce from the Student Community Support Agriculture, and information pertaining to local food and supply pantries. More resources will also be in the description below. What about the services offered outside of Truex campus? Both Truex and Goodman South have a contractual partnership with Second Harvest, the largest food bank in southwestern Wisconsin to offer pantries. In addition, food shelves are available at regional and commercial campuses during business hours. Please check with each campus front office to learn where the location is. The shelves offer more grab-and-go, easy snack type items. There are also various locations like the Center for Health and Well-Being, Student Life, and the Automotive Parts Store that have snacks or bagged lunches in case students need a meal. The cupboard offers so many ways to help students. My name is Talise. My name is Janvier Mukunzi. My name is Barbara Barr, and I grew up in Belleville, Wisconsin, which is uh, south of here. I'm from Escanaba, Michigan. I'm from East Africa, Rwanda, and I'm here in a program of economics and pre-business, planning to transfer to UWU. Math, a uh, liberal arts transfer program. Studying to become a first grade teacher. I work with the Madison College Food Pantry because food insecurity is a topic that's really near and dear to my heart. Moving like four hours away from my hometown, it was hard for me to find support. Uh, the cupboard was somewhere I could come that would offer me food, offered me a job. You know, the environment was really nice. Uh, the people are really friendly. I love working with them. So I got here three semesters ago, and I heard about uh, this food pantry at school. I was very interested to work with this food pantry to keep doing the same thing of helping students looking for where they can get their food, how they can get their resources, because I have, uh, have found that a lot of students, they don't, they don't know how they can find all that help. I guess what drew me to helping other students who suffer from food insecurity was being able to help someone who was in that same position that I was in. I would define food insecurity as not having enough food to last through the month. Any time that you're unable to eat, your life is too busy and you can't find time to make meals, or if you have someone else in your life that you're supporting that you have to feed them first before you can feed yourself. It's not having the money to afford to buy the food that you would like to eat, eating less than you normally would because there, there's not enough food for you or, or your family. Some people, they might live with this situation without knowing for some reasons, being shy of asking for help. I know a lot of students I've talked about, they're like, oh, I don't, I don't have food this week. And I'll be like, oh, go to the student pantry. And they're like, oh, but that's not really for me. I don't really need that. 
I didn't know what food insecure was until I was later in life. I was volunteering at a food pantry and it never occurred to me that I needed to go to the food pantry because I was struggling. We have seen like some students who might think that the food pantry is for here just to help poor people, but that's not a good mindset. We are here to help anybody who need this help, anybody who need this food. I think students at Madison College can support the food pantry by coming to our events, you know, being interested in like what we're doing. There's a little place where you can put some of your spare change and they're usually by the cash registers at the cafeteria. You can put spare change in there and that helps students that might not have money to buy lunch that day. Of course, come over, come talk to us, come grab a bag of food. If you need help, come over. We have our emails. If you need any question, if you need extra help, send us the email. You can also donate any leftover food you might have to the food pantry. I think that students can help their peers suffering from food insecurity by just being there for them. You know, don't make like a big deal out of it. Like, you know, offer things like the food pantry or maybe like a meal. They could make sure that they're offering their emotional support. Um, that goes a long ways and making sure students don't feel like that they are a failure if they're insecure. The shame of being food insecure makes people think that it's, it's me. It's not, I'm the only one that is going through this and that's so isolating. And so when, when we can let people we know that are struggling with that, that they're not alone and, and they're not a failure and you know, as life moves on. If I know you are my friend and you tell me that you're suffering with food and I have some extra cash, I can give you some money so that you can go get some groceries and help yourself. If you know this information, remember that there's a lot of students who doesn't have this information. Please share the information with your friends. Yeah, that's love. In 2024, the cupboard is planning for a major upgrade with a new expanded space and added food options for students. Please stay tuned to the Wolfpack Wisdom YouTube channel to learn more. We hope you have enjoyed this video. Be sure to check out the video description below for more information and helpful links. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more Wolfpack Wisdom.